you've already watched my uh, Air Jordan 1 Low Travis Scott video, then you'll recall the advice I gave everyone watching. Make sure you sit on those with the news Travis Scott gave us that they will not release any more pairs. It means your investment can really only go up from here. That was for y'all. That had nothing to actually do with me. See, I was happy to help uh, another buddy in the sneaker community out in turn to make sure that I secured something that I wanted myself. Cause it had nothing to do with just racking up as much money as I could on the resale. It had to do with the pair I missed out on in February and damn it, I finally got it. And well, you can probably guess it's something off white just based on the boxes behind me. TJ back with another video talks with TJ aka TJ two shoes chains we rocking all three today what is going on two shoes crew you see it down in the corner I love when you guys put that in the comments all the time hashtag two shoes crew just let let everybody know let them know what we on over here okay thank you for tuning in to this video if you're subscribed go ahead just hit just you know just keep commenting keep engaging i love it thank you all for the positive feedback constructive criticism all of that i appreciate it if you are not subscribed go ahead and subscribe okay we definitely do more than just sneakers over here we just talk about you know some life talks money management more importantly through budgeting and i'm going to have an entire kind of college series in august i'm gonna try to get that out every single wednesday just to give you guys some inside um just tips and things i would advise young people on and parents on when it comes to college i was an admission counselor for a year so i got some i got some insight only talk about what you really know about don't speak on stuff you don't know about that's that's the advice i would give anybody on youtube Thank you also for anybody who tuned into my Travis Scott video. I truly appreciate it. That thing is doing numbers. I'm proud of that. I had that thing in my hand less than like an hour and it was right out the door. But this here, I wanted this shoe for so long since Virgil did this. So you guys can already guess it is an off-white. Okay, so the off-whites that I have, uh, this here is for the uh, Vapor Max off-white. This is the Air Jordan one. This is the uh, UNC one. This is uh, the one a lot of people really wanted and missed on and I hit on that shock drop, okay? So if you guys are wondering where I picked this up, my little handy dandy buddy here, let's just pull that on down. StockX is where I actually went to pick this up. So we got bubble wrap there. Okay, always have a problem getting the box out. Oh, can you guys, well, you guys can guess. You've seen the thumbnail, okay? So this is the 10 Nike Air Max 90. Now, I'm usually a size six. I went with the six and a half because it was just a tiny bit cheaper by now price. But I went with the six and a half. So six and a half parachute beige bright mango style code AA7293200. Uh, these retail for 160 unfortunately i did pay retail but i didn't pay retail out of pocket because i resold the travis scott one so as you can see tag there we got the box here so similar to the box you guys see right there so it's off-white care of nike shoebox beaverage in oregon usa 2017. stock x Got my, uh, okay, got the, we got, we got our card here. And now I'm not gonna show this because of course it still has my address and everything, but I will show you guys the screenshot right here so you can see it. So here's a screenshot of the purchase. So yeah, the purchase price is $454, shipping $13.95, sales tax $32.76. So the total is $500.71, all right? 
put those to the side. I got another stock. I'm racking up stock X stickers at this point. You guys can see I did break down and buy some AirPods too. Uh, okay, I'll show. We'll, we'll, we'll try to show you guys as much as possible. Alright, so we got our paper here. The camera's moving. I'm, I'm, I'm excited, y'all. Oh my heavens, y'all, y'all, y'all! I don't even understand. Oh, oh, that, oh, y'all, it's plush. Woo. Oh, I'm so excited for this shoe. You, you just, y'all don't understand. Y'all don't understand. So we got stock, we got stock X tag, got stock X tag on there. Uh, so let's just go over. We all know what the Off-White Collection is known for, okay? It's a deconstruction of the typical model. Now listen, I've always said I, I find it a little weird if people have, they are more prone to get a collab versus actually liking the base model. So I have a base model, okay? So here is the Air Max 90. This is the Flyknit and the official colorway on this is Sail White Sand gum and yellow okay so i am a fan of the air max 90 itself i've had a few over the years and i've actually gotten rid of them now this is a little bit smaller than what i would normally wear this is a seven not a seven and a half in women's but because it is fly knit it does stretch and i just leave them loose lace so these are a six and a half and i mean i know you guys have seen this a ton a ton a ton but you're gonna see it from me that's just how this is gonna work this is my channel okay <laughs> So looking here, as you guys can see, we have the mango. Now it is a harder plastic material. It does have the stitching. Now this is a little bit different because if you look at the stitching on the VaporMax Off-White, it's like three layers of material under there. It's a little bit weird. Um, it's got the fused overlay stripe there in the base. No, I'm guessing they're still calling this base. Yeah, sure. We'll go with that. In the base, you do have the uh, teal tag here, which is different because this one has that or orange tag. They all have orange tags except for here. I'm so glad they went with a different color concept for this. This screams fall. I understand Tim's will hold up to a lot, y'all. I understand that. But this here is going to be my go-to fall shoe. Y'all going to get so tired of seeing this on my Instagram. Y'all really, y'all gonna get tired of seeing this on my Instagram. I'm not even joking. So let's just go over the shoe a little bit. You guys got to see. I So what I always like to do is give you guys that up close kind of slow motion B-roll of the shoe um, in hand. And then I like to give you some more uh, B-roll at the end. And then of course, and on foot. So I will do all of that. You guys can always, you know, catch me on IG with, with pictures and things like that. Um, now we have the signature text that is right here. So the off-white for Nike, you know, Nike Air Max 90, the Beaverton, Oregon. I love the different use of materials here. I think that was one of the amazing things they did with the 90 for the off-white collection um, collaboration with Virgil Abloh. Look, I mean, you have, we got Nubuck, we got Sway, we got the mesh here. I just think it's a great use. I think it adds character to this shoe. You have the exposed foam up here. Now, I guess I can go ahead and just take these out, get one out. Hopefully I don't destroy anything here. So I'm a fan of the exposed foam on these. I mean, I got, I got a few friends. They're gonna be mad at me for pulling these out, but it is what it is. Y'all just should be mad at me, okay? So you have the exposed foam there on the top, so exposed foam again you guys can see the text that's right there I'm trying to is there anything else extremely similar this one was weird the tag was stitched down on these and i always thought that was super weird so the tag is stitched down there now i i know some people are filling the, the white laces with these i didn't do white laces with mine i i did orange i wanted them to pop so i have orange laces in those what am I going to do with these? Oh my God, I'm losing. Y'all are seeing this in one take, okay? I'm about to destroy some stuff up here. My polo Yankees hat. It is a Nike hat too. I don't know if y'all know that. It is, it is a Nike hat. Everything I have is Nike. Okay, back to the shoe. Sorry, <laughs> it's all over the place. Um, on the inside, so we'll go ahead and take the shoe tree out. You see that men's six and a half. You have the inside sock liner that has the 10. Smells amazing. Passing the smell test. 
side tag there. We'll pull, go ahead and pull the other one out. And then, of course, this certain models had different types of zip tags. So this has the off-white care of Nike 2017. It's got the light blue one. And here's where you guys will find the other laces. So I, I the, the the laces are being changed. I just I have to make that known. The laces are being changed, y'all. I'm I'm probably just or I might just do one and one because I'm um in these. I have orange and white, so I might I might have to I might have to finesse this a little bit, put two different laces in here. But guys, where I mean, where did you rank the Desert Ore, uh, the Off White '90 Desert Ore, in the entire tin collection? I know this kind of went technically past the tin that came out in 2017. Let's not flame Virgil for that, okay? A lot of us appreciate this a lot more than the other ones. I definitely, I, I, when you look at certain prices. When it stays in the 400 to 450 range, I, I, okay, cool. Can rock with that. As it starts to get higher, like I really do want the off-white Presto, the all-black one with the white swoosh. This girl gonna have to wait on that. I'm gonna have to wait on that. <sighs> you see the excitement in my face? Oh, I'm so happy about these. Okay, well, you guys have seen me fangirl now over this shoe. Um, just understand I rock my shoes. They go straight to feet. There are a few that have not gone straight to feet But most of mine go straight to feet. So I am so extremely excited to get this in my hands uh, So drama, I hope you enjoy your Travis Scott uh, Jordan 1 lows rock those things across the stage for graduation when you are done with your bachelor's That is an amazing shoe to stunt to okay proud of you and I got my off-white I this is an amazing trait just well not really trait I resold, I got my pair, I have to pay none out of pocket. Your girl is happy. I'm happy, I'm gonna tell you this. I'm, I'm <laughs> happy, okay? Uh, man, the joy of getting a sneaker you really, really wanted. I don't think anything can top that. 